We're in Word 2019, Jasper Active Lesson 5. We're going to do the preparing to print activity. So when you get in there, you're going to see that you have this new adventures approved document open. And we're going to work on changing the print settings. We're not actually going to print anything. We're just going to look um, as if we were going to print. So we're going to do that on the file tab. So click on the file tab and you're going to see you have all these options over here on the left. We're going to select the print option and this is going to take us to a print preview screen. So what you will see is our documents over here. Down here at the bottom you're going to see how many pages there are. And then right here uh, a little left of center are all of your print options. So we have all kinds of things that we can do to change uh, the printing settings. So first of all, we want to increase the size of our preview so we can see the watermark. Now when we're in our print preview pane, we still have our zoom slider. So I'm just going to grab this and just zoom it in just so we can see how it's going to look when it's printed with this green watermark in the background. And I can zoom back out as well and see what it looks like. Now you'll notice when I zoom all the way out, it will show me all of the pages. I've got four pages in this document. It just lets you see how it's going to look. Um, now ultimately, if we go up to 100%, this is going to show us what it will actually look like when it's printed. And so there's some areas in our document that might be a little bit hard to read. All right, we can, um, so let me zoom back out and zoom in. We can use this zoom to page button. And I wanna make sure that you do that because Jasper has requested it. So if you click that, it's gonna bring you, you'll see it won't take you to 100%, but it takes us to 54%. That's so whatever, and yours might be different because based on the size of your monitor, um, it's gonna show us the entire page as one so it's zooming to the full page view now let's while we're in this view let's go down to our page buttons down here and let's click on the arrow that points to the right and this will take us through the rest of our document so we can see how it's going to look if we're zoomed all the way to the page and we're going to go back over to our print options here and the first thing we're going to do is here where it says copies, I want to change this. The default is one, but we can change it to however many copies we need. So if maybe I need to distribute more than one copy to some other people, um, I want to make multiple copies. So I'm going to use this up arrow and I'm going to change that to three. You can also uh, select the number and you could type in three. Either way. Other things that we can do in this view, we can change our orientation. Now, usually we do this when we're in um, our document, we use the layout tab, but we can actually change it in our print settings as well. So if I click on this, I can change it to landscape orientation. And then you'll see we get a horizontal zoom, uh, slider bar here, and it will show us what that would look like if we change the whole thing to landscape view. Now let's change our margins. That's another thing we can do here. Also something we usually do on our layout tab. But I'm going to change these to narrow margins and then see what that looks like for my document. Okay, and I can actually use, if you have a, a scroll wheel on your mouse, you can use that to go through your pages as well. There we go. Just so you can see what they look like. We're going to change um, our landscape or our orientation back to portrait instead of landscape. There we go. And then we're going to change our margins back to normal. There we go. So we put it right back where it was. Now at this point I could print. Um, but since we're not going to print, what I want to do is click on this back button up here that will take me back to my document. And that's it for today.